Feeling blue without you Give me one more chance Give me one more dance Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Hello beautifuls. How are you doing today? This is actually just going to be a quick little update on the Jeffree Star mystery boxes which you saw my other video for when I was ordering them. So my premium box is due to be here tomorrow according to shipping from Killer March on informed delivery from USPS. My Deluxe box and Supreme box actually just got shipped out and they should be here early next week. So as soon as I get that premium box, girl, I'm going to be opening it and you know it. So I've seen previews, I've seen spoilers of each and every single box. I actually have my little phone with me real quick and I actually saved a couple of the pictures because I'm in some... Uh, Jeffree Star Cosmetics groups on Facebook. Hi guys, if you're watching this. Um, so I pretty much know what to expect with like a couple different variations. And I'm, am I still excited for the boxes? Yes, yes I am. I'm excited for some of the items in there. Um, I had my eyes and stuff hoping for some very specific items anyway couple of them which are in the boxes that I will be keeping everything I decide not to keep I will be selling off um, um I'm also, yeah so I'm letting my sister pick one item out of one of the boxes because she agreed to do an unboxing video with me for you guys for this channel it's gonna be loads of fun I can tell you Okay, so let's see. The first thing I pull up is for the premium box. This was on Twitter. It gave you a list of the contents and a list of every, like, and pictures and stuff that were with it. I know there's some variations with it, so then everything that's actually in this box. To me, it still seems like a pretty good box. Was it worth the $145? No, honestly. This should have been marketed at $100, but it wasn't. Um, so for the Supreme box, you get one of the new Jeffree Star approved seal mirrors. Uh, Blue Blood is in this box as well, just like it was in the Black Friday boxes, as well as the Beautylish um mystery boxes that they did. Um, a velour lip scrub, that one I know can come in several different flavors, just depends on what they had. The Brain Freeze Pro palette, which happens to be one of his highlighter ones, that's actually one of the items I'm looking forward to because I don't have any of his highlighters, I just have mainly my Ofra highlighters. A couple others, um, I do have this. It's Too Faced Natural. I use that as a uh, highlighter palette as well. Um, I was hoping for an Extreme Frost, but we didn't get that. You know, these boxes are mostly made out of inventory they have left over that's probably going to expire soon, and rather than have to torch it, they put it in the mystery boxes for sale so it doesn't go to waste and you still get a discounted prop. So it's not terrible. Um, you also get three velour liquid lipsticks, each one in a different shade. I've seen a couple variations of these as well. Um, two of the glosses, those vary too. I've seen a couple different ones. Um, one of the new side bags that go across the body. That'll be cute. Um, so far, I've seen the red and the pink as a variation for those. Um, like always, a pop socket in his little boxes. And um, the Candy Hearts tote bag, which in my opinion isn't worth much. From the pictures, it looks like the material it's made out of isn't even canvas. It looks like the ones that I buy from the dollar store that are made out of polyester. Um, next on here, I have the picture, this one right here. 
that is for the deluxe box, the $100 box. Honestly, the $100 box should have been marketed as a $60 box. Which is my opinion. It has the mini breaker again, which was also basically in every single box last year. Um, a pink Jeffree Star hat. There is some news going on that recently that the hat matched the one that was on the website. The colors were different, the materials were different, but it was too close for comfort for some people. Especially when Jeffrey was saying that was supposed to be an exclusive item. Uh, this box has a t-shirt. Most of us were hoping for a hoodie or a jacket, Jeffrey. But we got a t-shirt with candy hearts on it. I won't be keeping that. Definitely not. No, 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 no. Uh, there was one of the star mirrors. Uh, the variations I've seen for that is the white holiday mirror, which I actually bought with the premium box for my sister for her birthday. Could have saved me some money and not had to buy it. Well, if that's the one I get in the box, but that's the most popular one. Some of the other ones have been, been getting the black chrome star mirror or the baby pink star mirror that's been around for two, three years now at least. Um, it also comes with a four pack of the metal stars from Jeffrey. I've seen those in both the black ones and the green ones. The uh, exclusive um, lipstick as well as one of the glosses as well as the 24 karat um, highlighter palette. That one is also something I would be keeping. Honestly, I'll only be keeping three items in this box, which makes me really, really sad. This is that screenshot about the whole hat thing and everybody was getting angry. Go check it out on Twitter. They're still having a fight over it. Um, I don't think I have the preview for the premium box on here, but I know what's in it anyway. In the premium box, all the premium boxes so far have showed up with the Jeffree Star Alien palette, which is now discontinued. They won't be making and selling it anymore. Um, maybe eventually as like a limited edition run, probably in the future for some extra money. People have been selling those for crazy amounts of money when it was on sale for $40 before it got discontinued. And I've seen people selling them for upwards of $150 high end and low end like $75. Kind of the same thing with the Thirsty Palette, guys. It's not worth it. <laughs> it's not. But the premium box has the... Jeffree Star Alien palette has this cute beanie. So far I've seen the beanie in red, pink, and black. The beanie is something I'm hoping for that I will be keeping. Um, I've seen some have a lip scrub. Um, others have a lip gloss or a lipstick as well as a pop socket in their box. That's pretty much all I can tell you on those for now. Like I said, I get my box tomorrow. As soon as I get that box, I'll do an unboxing and I'll post an ASAP for you guys, just so you know. But that is our update for today. Have fun. Go on Twitter. Enjoy the drama. Read in. See some spoilers. You're not missing anything. Trust me, it's there. If you've been trying to stay away from the spoilers, it's going to be really, really hard. And then again, oh, why are you watching this video? <laughs> but, uh... Join me this weekend for unboxing that premium box with that alien palette secret. I bought two of the premium boxes. I didn't know the alien palette was going to be in it. So I will be keeping one of those just to have because it's got these pretty yellow gold shades in it that I really, really want. That most of Jeffree stuff doesn't seem to have. And then I will probably either be giving, giving away or selling away the other Alien palette as well as a bunch of other stuff in the boxes that I get depending on what my sister chooses and what she wants. So good evening, good night, good morning, whatever it is for you. You guys have an excellent day slash night. And I've got to go do some digging and get some homework and stuff uh, sorted out before the next video. He's real, guys. Bye. Feeling blue without you. Give me one more chance. Give me one more dance.